Hello, I'm Stuart from Elite Optical and today we're going to take a look at the new Condor 2 Thermal Monocular from Hike Micro. The Condor has been an important part of the Hike Micro Thermal Monocular range for the last few years and this update is really exciting. Hike have built in some new technology so we're just going to run through those features first before we take a detailed look through the unit. The first update is they're now using a sub-15 NET-D sensor. The NET-D is the measure of the smallest temperature difference that the thermal monocular can detect. The sensor builds its image by comparing two pixels next to each other and measuring that temperature difference. So the lower the NET-D, the more accurate the sensor is, and that gives you two advantages. The first one is more detail in your image. So you're seeing more information on the heat source, but also more of the foreground and the background. So you're building a picture of the distance and also the situational awareness that the animal is in. The other advantage of a low net D high performance sensor is when we're experiencing challenging conditions such as fog or rain, which happens a lot here in the UK. Those atmospheric conditions interrupt the signal that's being emitted from the heat source and stop it from arriving at the thermal monocular. This highly accurate sensor can still detect those small signals and deliver a really good image even when the conditions are terrible. Another feature which Hike Micro introduced to their products late last year is shutterless technology. Hike Micro have now introduced that into the Condor 2 and the Falcon 2 and it's the first thermal monoculars that offer this upgrade. But what does it actually mean? The shutter is required to remove noise from the sensor and to complete its operation, it physically wipes across the sensor surface. You hear the click and you also see your image freeze. Hike Micro have developed advanced software which now controls that noise and removes the need to have that interruption, giving you a complete uninterrupted view of your surroundings and removing that annoying image stop and click that you find during operation. The other focus for Hike Micro during this new product development has been creating thermal monoculars which can be operated with one hand. The main advancement in this process has been bringing the focus away from the objective lens where you need two hands to manually hold the unit and operate the focus and we now find that conveniently located on this roller dial which is operated with your index finger. That gives you a precise one-handed control of your thermal monocular and allows you to keep the perfect crisp image in focus all of the time. Another area that Hike Micro have improved for the Condor 2 is the screen in the back of the unit. This is now absolutely massive and gives you a really immersive and clear view of all the detail that this latest generation sensor can detect. It also has the option to add curved sides onto the screen. So you can use it with the conventional rectangular display, or if you prefer, with the software, you can add in the curved edges that give you a more traditional appearance that you'd see with a monocular or glass binocular. Some of the other software features that Hike have introduced in the Condor 2 is Image Pro 2, which is giving you advanced processing and sharpening the image up. We've also got some new colour palettes, including red monochrome and green monochrome. I was in Scotland using this product last week, and I found that red monochrome really easy on your eye, especially in the dark. There was no eye strain, and it also picked out the heat sources very clearly, making detection of animals really straightforward. Another feature that Hick have added to the Condor 2 is the ability to play back your videos and photos on the device. You used to have to connect your phone and transfer images or videos across to watch them on there or plug into a laptop. You can now also review those straight from the unit, which is great if you're out in the field and you want to quickly watch back some of your action that you've just captured. So let's take a more detailed look through the Condor 2 and the features that Hike Micro have built into this product. The first thing that you notice as soon as you pick it up is the quality of the materials and how solid the magnesium alloy chassis feels. There's some great rubber textures and it just feels really comfortable and high quality in your hands. Coming to the front of the unit and at the top here, we find the lens for our thermal camera. This is the CQ50 model with its high magnification 
2.7 times base mag. We also offer this unit with a 35mm focal length that gives us a more compact lens and a 1.9 times base mag. Both models use a 640 pixel sub 50 net D sensor, so that's got lots of resolution to give you the detail, and also that latest generation sub 50 net D performance to give you excellent detection power, even in the harshest of conditions. This being the 50 millimeter model, we've got that large lens on the front, it's also giving us the highest detection distance, and this is really gonna help us to identify small heat sources over longer distance. So if you want to be able to find foxes and identify them reliably, this is the model to look for. If you want to be able to scan an area quickly with a wider field of view, then our 35 mm Condor 2 is absolutely perfect for you. And we'd recommend actually go into the shops, check out the field of view, and make sure that you choose the model which best suits your needs. Underneath our thermal camera and tucked away in here we find our 1000 meter laser rangefinder module. This makes it easy to judge the distance to heat sources even in total darkness. Coming further back the unit and on top we've got our three buttons that complete all the major controls that we're going to need out in the field. They give us access to the laser rangefinder, switching colour palette and accessing the menu to adjust things like the brightness and contrast. They also allow us to activate recording of images and video, which you can also do by connecting to Hike Microsites app and streaming or recording straight into your phone. Next to the three control buttons, we find that innovative new roller focus dial. And you'll notice as we use that, the roller dial falls perfectly onto my index finger and then the three buttons all have a finger to control them. So this unit truly can be used single-handedly. Hikmicro have also added anchor points on this side to allow you to put the hand strap here if you want to use the unit with your left hand. Also on this side of the unit, we find the power button. This is conveniently located and easy to access with our thumb. We've decided to move the power button away from the controls that we use during the field to reduce the chance of an accidental power down whilst you're trying to activate another control, especially easily done when you're using the unit in the dark. Moving our way further back the unit, we've got the diopter adjustment around the eyepiece. You just need to set that once to match your eye and get the icons inside the screen really clear. Once you've set that, forget it, and you use the main focus to adjust the distance whilst you're using the unit in the field. Moving further back, and we've got an upgraded eye cup that's really easy to use and it gets that wing completely out of the way, which is really handy, especially if you're using it with glasses. And inside here, you see that amazing OLED display, which is giving us that widescreen and immersive view of all the detail that's captured by that sub 15 net D sensor and displaying it to us on a massive immersive display with the option to add those rounded edges and bring that traditional look into this latest technology. Underneath the eyepiece and we find the newly designed battery cover. It's more robust and it houses a 21700 larger capacity battery which is giving us up to 6.5 hours runtime. The Condor is supplied with a charger and two of these batteries which gives us up to 13 hours runtime in total and these batteries are readily available and affordable so it's easy to carry a pocket full of these if you've got an extended trip planned. So, that was our quick overview of the new Condor 2 Thermal Monocular from Hike Micro. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Please remember to follow us for the latest news from Hike Micro and all of our elite optical brands. Thank you very much for watching.